dear students learners and viewers welcome to my youtube channel learn english with rk in this video lecture we are going to start a new series on models or model of the arrays before we start where we use models how we use models why we use models we need to know the meaning of verb what are verbs they are in fact action words kriya hai action words kehna wo kisi karya ke hone ka bodh karati hai jaise i am teaching you you are listening to me you are watching me so listening watching teaching these are action words ye kriya hai but when you are you are that to is a verb but that is helping you so broadly we have two types of verbs there are action verbs and auxiliary verbs and we also call helping verbs again we have two action verbs there are transitive verbs and intransitive verbs transitive verbs take direct object and intransitive verbs do not take direct object and what is direct object transitive and positive so we will have a separate video lecture on verbs and their types second category is auxiliary verbs again we have two types they are primary auxiliary and modal auxiliary primary auxiliary they are do the did has have had and be this is present form is a mark and past form was word and the second auxiliary verb is modal auxiliary jo ki hamara topic bhi so today we are going to discuss what modal auxiliary is or what modal are so they are now 13 what are they can could may might will would tell should must ought to you have to hum mein rahega used to ye two saath mein rahega need there dekhiye ye teen model ko mein alag se likha hai because these used need and there we can use them both as models and main box in a model to main box dono ko prayog kiya gaya hai jaise you need not go there model you do not need to go there main model so we shall discuss that or not just going to check a very separate video lecture here. now our main point is models what are models how do they help us see we use models to indicate the modalities like likelihood ability commission obligation advice suggestion offer request ye sab modalities ke baat hai aise modalities ko express karne ke liye indicate karne ke liye we use models with the main verb base form to ye modalities kya hai we can call bhav manobhav hamare andar कोई एबिलिटी का भाव है तो हम कैन मॉडल का प्रयोग करेंगे जैसे आई कैन गो देयर आई कैन बी आई कैन टॉक इन इज तो ऐसे मोडालिटीज मनोभावों को व्यक्त करने के लिए वी नीड एन यूज मॉडल जिसकी चर्चा वन बाय वन करेंगे व्हाट आर द कैरेक्टरिस्टिक्स ऑफ मॉडल्स और मॉडल ऑफ द रियली इनकी विशेषताएं क्या है First characteristic is that they take base forms of main verbs. वो हमेशा main verbs का base form के साथ प्रयोग करते हैं. Then what is base form? Means first form. Like speak is the 
बेस्ट फॉर्म थॉट इज द बेस्ट फॉर्म जिसमें कोई सेकेंड थर्ड फॉर्म नहीं होता जिसमें एपीएससी लगाते हैं हम देन वी कॉल इट बेस्ट फॉर्म तो देखिए मॉडल के बाद हमेशा वॉक का बेस्ट फॉर्म आता है फॉर एग्जाम्पल ही कैन स्पीक फ्रेंच तो ही कैन स्पीक इज बेस्ट फॉर्म वी कैन नॉट ही कैन स्पीक फ्रेंच वी कैन नॉट एट एस बिकॉज वी आर यूजिंग इट ऑफ द मॉडल कैन सिमिलरली दे शुड कम ऑन टाइम कम इज बेस्ट फॉर्म एंड सो इज मॉडल तो दिस इज फर्स्ट कैरेक्टरिस्टिक दिस इज बेस्ट फॉर्म ऑफ द मेन सेकेंड कैरेक्टरिस्टिक इज मॉडल्स आर यूज टू मेक इंफॉर्मेटिव एंड नेगेटिव सेंटेंसेस एज वी आर सीन इज द प्राइमरी ऑब्जिलिटी इनका प्रयोग भी हम जो है प्राइमरी ऑब्जिलिटी की तरह सेंटेंस को नेगेटिव एंड इंफॉर्मेटिव बनाने के लिए करते हैं जैसे इंफॉर्मेटिव सेंटेंस हमने लिखा किया ही कैन बी इंफॉर्मेटिव कैन ही बी क्या वो दे सकता है नेगेटिव ही कॉन्ट बी या नेगेटिव प्लस इंफॉर्मेटिव बना तो कॉन्ट ही बी क्या वो नहीं दे सकता सो ये हमारे को मदद करते हैं इंफॉर्मेटिव और नेगेटिव सेंटेंसेस बनाने के लिए सो दिस इज द सेकंड कैरेक्टरिस्टिक ऑफ मॉडल नाउ ये शॉर्ट फॉर्म या कॉन्ट्रैक्शन हमें क्यों जानना चाहिए यदि हम अंग्रेजी फ्लुएंटली बोलना चाहते हैं धारा प्रवाह में अंग्रेजी बोलना चाहते हैं इफ यू वॉन्ट टू स्पीक इंग्लिश फ्लुएंटली सो यू यू नीड टू नो दिस कॉन्ट्रेक्शन और शॉर्ट फॉर्म ऑफ द मॉडल्स विथ नॉट इसे के नॉट इज कॉन्ट और कैंट कॉन्ट विच इज इन कैंट अमेरिका देखो मैंने यहां देखो कैन और नॉट को साथ साथ लिखा है कभी भी आप कैन नॉट अलग अलग करके नहीं लिखे नेवर यूज कैन नॉट लाइक दिस ये कैन और नॉट हमेशा साथ में लिखे जाते हैं आप देखिए इसके बाद जब भी आप पढ़ेंगे कोई पुस्तक को तो सो कैन नॉट इज रिटर्न टूगेदर वी कैन नॉट राइट कैन एंड नॉट सेपरेटली कुड नॉट शॉर्ट फॉर्म कुड Will not, won't. See here. Short form of will not is won't. Never use will. Generally, we make mistake here. Would not, wouldn't. Shall not, can't. But this too is very formal use. We rarely use can't in spoken English. That doesn't sound good. Should not, shouldn't. Must not, mustn't. Again. Don't pronounce it as mustn't. Never ever say mustn't. What should you say? Mustn't. Mustn't. The pronunciation is mustn't. Next word may not, mayn't. Might not, mightn't. But keep in mind, uh, we may use in written English, but in spoken English, saying mayn't and mightn't. Both sound very awkward. So, can we both say that man and mission is a prayer? Not going to happen. You better use may not and might not. Used not, use usen. Again, don't say usen. How have you to pronounce usen? Need not, needn't. They are not, didn't. But what did I wish to add here? While using contractor, you can follow either American version or British version. आप American version में T का pronunciation ना करें और British version में T का pronunciation करें। इसलिए can't, when you say to British, can't, so we just say T. Couldn't, when you say T, couldn't, British version, couldn't. In the same way, won't, won't. Wooden, wooden, sun, sun, sudden, sudden. So you can drop the okay, American one. So dear friends, this is all about the introduction on model from the new video lecture. We will be starting model one by one. Most probably. 
in the next video lecture i will be discussing two models must and should i hope you must have got something new from this video lecture or uh, and if it is so it is yes, as please i need your support and how can you support me by sharing this video subscribing it and liking and making a comment